going on, y'all? It's your boy, Mr. Stainless, out of Norfolk, Virginia, from Shark City, VA. Like I said, I um, promised the YouTube tutorial video. Um, I want to give a huge shout out to my, uh, my boy, Mal, uh, my boy, Doc, and uh, Set TV. So, definitely much love. And uh, as you see, this is the shoe I've been doing on my Facebook Live. If you, don't, if you haven't added me on my Facebook Live, my Facebook is Demarcus Walker. And then um, my Instagram is at Remain Stainless Customs. And then I do have a Snapchat where it's Remain Stainless with one S. All the info will definitely be in the bio. And as you see, this is the shoe I'll be working on. I'm trying to make sure we go from this to this. Full in depth tutorial. If you got any questions, you know, make sure that you um, hit it up in the comment box and um, we'll definitely get right into it. Uh, first thing we're going to do, I'm going to take the shoe apart. And as you see, it's all crumbly and it's nasty. There's ain't even no point of even trying to um, re glue it back. And I'm going to try to get the residue of all this stitching right here. So um, I'm going to definitely take this apart unstitch this and take this off so let's go ahead and get into it uh, you definitely want to take your time with this and uh, what I'm doing with this uh, I'm heating up all the old stuff in the shoe and taking it and trying to make sure that I get everything off and I'm trying to liquefy the, the fabric glue so it'll be easy to come off so this is the stuff that I use um, as you see, the, the crumbling is not as bad as I ran to with other shoes in the past. Because if it was real terrible, I would have to use a different method. And as you see, all the crumbling come apart. Um, so what I'm going to do is, as you see, the threads to the toe cap. These are like the main things I definitely want to do, so I'm definitely trying to make sure I get this off. And uh, this right here that I have is a uh, soft grit sim ripper. You can get this at um, you can get this at your local fabric store, Michaels, Joanne Fabrics. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, get into that. Sole is gone, ain't no need of me using that because um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the shoe off. Uh, actually, a shoe I found on eBay, found it for $40, and all I need is the midsole off this uh, the Spizite, the Siemens Spizite right here. So, um, we'll go ahead and get into continue taking the glue off. What do you want? What do you want? Holy moly moly low, low Want to one to one and not the two 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 finger up, I shot those Still drinking Grand Cru, it's a Grand Cru 27, 24, 24, 7, shit simple Pay attention, switch the ignition Different key to get in, look me in my face You wanna fucking, you meant it, ain't offended Just shoot me a mention, every movie business Every day I'm busy, tell my old All right, as you see, what we'll do next This is acetone, no it's not water That's why I got the blue tape to indicate that it's acetone Not an ass, but I'm feeling top shelf Order that, fingers count the order that so what I'm going to do is take the acetone and while it's hot, try to take all the old glue off and the rest of it to the point where it's clean. I'm lying and I'm dying. My habit never caught in me. Facts. 19 Facts. peeping at my steel. Wait, he knew I cruised the road. 
youngin' with this old soul I had too many hoes Another one is what he called Another Lose I call him DJ Kelly Hit the lane he Made the right on grass Ash it Solo dolo Ain't no need to pass it Thoughts drippin' Man it ain't no need to gas it Reminisce old times I could walk in pallets Me and all my cousins On the pallets When I snap back at it Got up by my mom's at pallets Go get it Dallas, low, low. Acrobatic low. Facebook changes Stabbing Tryna be a brace of brackets Close the gap It's closing on that money Like a lap dance We should've been Had this Let's get it Let's get it Got these tweezers, you can get these pretty much anywhere, Walmart, um, at your local drugstore. And what I use these for is I take these take these little um, take these little threads out this right here. So let's go ahead and get into it. Sounds for a pimp, man. It's time to feed the streets. Uh. <laughs> As you see. As you see, we remove all the factory glue, we remove all the residue, everything is completely done at the bottom. Next step I'm going to do is clean the shoes. You see, the shoe is real dirty, and not only that, the main, this is one of, this is one of the main steps is cleaning the shoe. So, uh, the reason I clean the shoe, because like I said, you don't want any dirt or anything, or uh, any type of obstruction in the way, and one of the, plus I want the shoe to be kind of bright. Right, white again. So I'm gonna clean the shoe with is uh, the shoe nail. You can um, the link will definitely be in the description. Shout out to the good people at the shoe nail. And uh, let's go ahead and get into it. And uh, what I'm doing is I'm taking a taking a suede brush and making me a nice foam all over the shoe. I'm gonna make sure you get you a nice foam. I'll engage the rip and doze and take her mama out the mountains, make me babies every summer. I got 99 problems. Pippin's all purple brush. Bang a million women, never telling lies. Every time I bust a nut, baby, homicide. Shout support, come and throw that money in the sky. Uh, don't make me grab a tail. Bust you like a mold, I'll wipe you off the man. From baby James bah, in the play We call you so courtesy of my little <laughs> tag I sure don't make you bad at But you like the mold, I'll wipe you off the man I'm about to do next I'm gonna go ahead and ask Tony to shoot down Because I uh, got little spots like that Little sticky parts like that Stuff like this where I took a heel tab off of And left a uh, blue residue from it and then not only that, um, I'm going to repaint the shoe. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, acetone the shoe down. So let's go ahead and get into it. Skins like Brian Pumper, 2 a.m. Scully Young, hit this to the grind. I got money, I got money, big Frankie on my mind. I was moving too fast. Wifey try to slow my tempo. Never understand, get that out of here, move tumble. Blocking all haters, showing no remorse. Recipe. Chevy Red Porsche, I'm addicted to the wallet. Call me David Blaine, popping up when least suspected. Then she better be on game. Me so horny for the chatter, got me losing, leaving stains. I be up all night, uh, plotting on the play. Uh, don't make me grab a tail. But you like the mold, I wipe you off the man. Uh, I'm baby James, you can play. You call me so courtesy of my little tail. I said don't make me grab a tag But you let them move the white you off the man Alright, that's the last one And the thing is, after you do the acetone after you do the acetone, you definitely want, uh, I let the shoe sit for 30 minutes. So by that time, I'm going to and move on to the next step. And uh, the next step is, I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is I'm going to unstitch the first bottom of the shoe. And then I'm going to take all this out, all the stitching is um, left over from the old tab. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'm to And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my X-Acto knife. All right, yeah, right. And I'm going to try to use you some of the, um, you the seam of the Zacto knife you can get at, um, you can pretty much get at any fabric store. Okay. And you can also get it at any hardware. Yeah, you can get it at your wall or your target. <laughs> that boy, you so let's go ahead and get to it.
don't get married again. Go ahead. You go ahead, African man. I'm not about to be out here committing adultery. I'm gonna find me one. She... It is committing adultery. You talking about having five wives? No, 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 no. I'm talking about it. Oh, I'll be on that one time. No, if they leave me, uh -huh. fine, I'm gonna get another one. Replace <laughs> So you just tell me you're not going to be alone no, at all? I'll never be alone. Yeah, I'll never be alone. No, you never. You won't be. I ain't alone either. As long as I got God, I know I ain't alone. I'm never going to be alone. The reason I'm doing the bottom row because I want to make sure that I stick this uh, hill tab in there correctly. So, let's go ahead and get into it. I ain't playing. I got daughters. I ain't, I ain't with that lifestyle. I understand that. Yeah. How can I tell my son to do better than ours? Oh, drink, line up, ready. Shoot. Hey, they waiting. They are waiting. I said, hey, said Rodney, so if you and your wife don't work out, I said, look, this is God's will. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, I heard you. I said, I'm trying to work it out with my wife, you know, with God's will. I'm going to tell you something, Mom. I know where I'm supposed to be at. If, 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 this game, if this dream is really doing what it's doing, then I know exactly where I'm supposed to be. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to lie to you. I know where. I know where. And I, I'm just okay. saying, I, I, I got to come back home. If this dream was really real, if I had... Old street, don't let me go nowhere because I was going to be with somebody else and they're going to put me on child support and I'm going to have girls. I know. I know who. I know who. Huh? I'm I know who. And as you see, the area is pretty much clean and is ready for me to insert this tab. And um, this tab that I brought, you can buy $40. As a matter of fact, you buy a pair of these tabs for $40. Buy a pair of these tabs, forty dollars from uh, Beat the Heat Restorations. The link will definitely be in the description. So shout out to my boy Kenny Stoutman at Beat the Heat Restorations. I will put the link. Of, I will put his link in the description. What I'm gonna do next is um, I'm gonna put a stitch in his heel tab, and I'm only gonna put the stitching around here where the stitching will show. Uh, I'm gonna just leave leave this. I'm gonna put no stitching in it, and uh, I'm gonna tell you the reason why. After I put the stitch in here, well, I'm going to put no stitch in this yet. So I'm going to go ahead and put the stitch in there. So let's go ahead and get into it. For the competition, yeah. I see you feeling like you optimistic. I'm with my niggas, we just kick it, we be politics. I don't know what this called. This little piece right here, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it through the needle. Put my thread through here. And um, the best thread to use when it comes to stitching is nylon. Nylon is... Um, Nylon is real tough um, and it will definitely last long. It got a lot of strength to it. So, what I'm going to do is put the needle through here, pull this down, and as you see, I have the needle through. And uh, also, another thing that I do, I have a whole different color of the thread, and the reason I'm using two different threads is because I'm doing a double back stitching. And uh, it's best to use a thread that's two different colors so you won't get the color confused when you start putting your needle through. So we go ahead and get into that. And um, when you're doing this, the main thing that you want to do is you always want to pull the other end through so you can have what I call the bitter end to the inside. And then what you want to do is pull this needle out so you can have this needle to the outside and that's how you got that through so let's go ahead and get into it and the thing is you never want to stick this needle all the way through because what you're going to wind up doing is wind up breaking breaking the um, tab apart and you don't even need to stick it that through so what I'm doing is I'm sticking it through I'm pulling it from one end and I'm sliding it right out and then go to needle and as you see Right here I have a loop, what I call a rabbit ear. And once you see that loop, I take this black one, put it through right here, and I pull 
majority of it through because I'm trying to get it all the way around. So I have the end that's holding the thread and the actual thread is showing. I'm holding the actual black part and I'm pulling it. And as you see, once you do that all the way through, you will see that you actually have the thread showing. Now for some reason, a lot of people have difficulty with this, but for some reason, if, if your thread get twisted, you know, all you gotta do, for instance, if you get thread get twisted and you can't pull it out, what you do is you just stick it back in, pull on it, pull it back out, pull from the other side, pull it through. So just pretty much continue that all the way through. Once again, I'm taking the end. Summertime is the summertime. Yeah, yeah, the summer mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. 28, man. 28? Young man, young man, young man. Yeah, 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 get the better than your real man. Now, come on, man. Yeah, that's a blessing, man. That's a blessing, man. Before I land the hearse, I put my life in the verse. Family Alright, this is the last part of the stitching, and as you see, I am putting the needle through. And then this time, as I put it through, once again, I'm holding it, pulling it out. And the only thing I'm doing different is I'm holding it instead of me taking this black string that I got here and putting it through. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hold on to it, and then I'm going to cut. After I cut it, I'm going to pull it all the way through. And then all the stitching and everything will be at the end. And anything that you got coming up that you don't want, all you got to snap that. Just snap it and it definitely won't be visible through the shoe. And as you see, and then uh, cut anything else that you don't want. Or if it's too long, you cut that. And then pretty much right here, another cut. Pretty much you got your stitched up tab right here. And um, it may have the other color show through, but once you put it on, it won't be that, definitely won't be that visible. But the whole thing is up close, it definitely will look clean. All right, what I'm doing next is that I'm gonna put the stitching around through. And uh, once again, I'm using the same step as I did before. Um, so as you see, put the stitching through. Pulling the needle out, and as you see, I got that started. Making one more. As you see, I'm taking my black string, putting it through the loop, and uh, all the double back stitching, and bring it in, and then that's pretty much the start of it, and then you can pretty much continue the rest after, um, on after that. Getting in these close arguments in the phone Blue chips in the green, she in the heart, we prone Delegate, we get the money, then we wire at home I came back to my house and my family was gone Man, you know, it's crazy, man, you know We be working so hard out there They don't understand what we be going through So it's like, why y'all giving us a headache? We out here trying to do the best we can for y'all. We trying to provide, trying to send home dinners. This is Sailor Gang Entertainment. And I go by the name of Rodney Bang. And this is Sailor Scott. Amen. Pray for us. You, you and I, it's, it's our world, all right? It's no, it's you, it's you, RJ, and Fatima. Yeah. No, it is not.
Another day, another dollar, God bless it. I ain't with the bull, I confess it. I ain't got time for the small talk. Gotta grind every minute, no resting. Little free, calling back to back now. Nah. Probably ain't important, she can text it. She got an attitude and a message. I don't give a damn, I don't stress it. I, I ain't chasing nothing but the money. Pussy gon' have to get a number. I'm about to kill them all winter. Just to do it all again, all summer track running since I'm young and I've been dreaming about the cup. Only thing on a nigga mind, so I'm working overtime, sun down to the sun. A nigga ain't getting no younger. A nigga, I've been putting in the time. Man on a mission with the grind. I don't see you niggas, I'm blind. I don't need a break, I'm fine, I'm good. Gonna be well worth it when the nigga shine. Guarantee the stars will align. No way, I'm gonna be denied. I just say I got the stitching in, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the threads. Um, definitely, I want to leave the black one, the one that's holding the white thread. I want to kind of leave that a little bit longer than normal because I definitely don't want to cut it short for the rest of the stitching will unravel. So I'll probably cut it about a good, leave like a good two inches of um, thread left on the, on the double back and the one that's holding the one that's showing. You probably cut it like a good two inch, one inch. Give yourself enough room to show, and then, like I said, you can take the rest of it, kind of tuck it in, and it definitely won't show. And then, um, this white one, like I said, you can definitely cut that. And then, uh, that's pretty much it. I got the stitching in the shoe, just making sure that I cut everything. Once again, this is the other end. Other black string which I still have attached to the um, to the spool. So I'm gonna cut that about good one inch, two inch. Because you, like I said, once you cut it too short, next thing you know your stitching um your, your, your stitching will unravel on its own. And once again I got everything tucked in. Once the next step is what I'm doing, I'm putting the tab in. I don't see you niggas, I'm blind. I don't need a break, I'm fine, I'm good. Gonna be well worth it when the niggas shine. Guarantee the stars will align. No way, I'm gonna be definitely want to kind of wiggle yourself in. As you see, I got it in there. Only thing is, I need to get this up, uh, come hold, uh, be able to hold it down. So the next step I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this uh, finisher glue. Uh, shout out to my boy Devin Broswell for uh, FDCC. Uh, out of all the glues I didn't use, this is some of the best glue I use. Uh, like I said. It, cures really fast, it sticks, it does its job, and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put finishing glue up in this area, and then once I got the finishing glue down on this area, I'm going to continue on the inside of the tab and work my way up. So, uh, once again, it's FBCC finishing glue, and let's go ahead and get into the floor. The thing is, you don't want to use too much glue. You just want to use enough so when you press it, you won't have that much glue coming out. And the glue is real clear, so when it dries up, it dries up real clear, and you don't got to worry about a huge mess showing through. That's why I like about this glue so much. And um, I will definitely leave the link for um, FBCC also in the description. As you see, 
Uh, it, it dries up real quick. I say five minutes tops. Uh, it dries up really quick. And then uh, to show you that um, the glue, that the glue right here, it actually works. But I'm not done yet. I'm gonna glue, um, I'm gonna glue the more outer part of it, and then after that, we're done with the um, tab. As you see, I got the tab in uh, nice and perfect. Uh, once again, shout out FDCC, good shoe glue, good finisher shoe glue. So shout out to him. Leave, leave a link in the description, and we're gonna get on to the next step. All right, right now I'm about to take this off. This um, the cement, uh, this Jordan cement Fizzite. And uh, I'm gonna use the same process I did to take the sole off, but this time I'm gonna be very careful because I wanna make sure I don't wanna do nothing to damage the sole, and I gotta go out and get another donut for the customer. So um, let's go ahead and get into it. I'm gonna start with the toe box, and then from there, I'm gonna take the shoe apart by using my heat gun. So let's get into it. So once again, I got my heat gun, and um, as you see, I done got some of it apart. All right, and as you see right here, I took the midsole apart. Um, the actual rubber, the actual midsole, and the next step I'm gonna do is that um, I'm gonna take the rest of this paint off by using the acetone. Uh, as you see, the acetone is not getting off like I want, so the next step I'm gonna use is I'm gonna use this um, Dance Easy Spray from um, Taylor Do Yourself and your, uh, from Taylor's Do It Yourself. And I'm um, definitely gonna put it on and you're gonna definitely see how it works. So let's go ahead and get into it. Um, taking a regular paintbrush, something I don't use. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna just start painting the midsole. Just like you paint. And uh, actually what this does, is actually make it easier for me due to the fact that the midsole is off. I don't gotta worry about doing all the damage to the shoe because it's just the midsole that I'm painting. And as you see, if you look closely, what the Dad Easy Spray is doing, it, it's kind of making everything rise up and it makes it for me easier to take, take all the uh, rest of the paint on the mid so off, so let's get into it. I was one of the first to hear what she had to say. I feel blessed to have bear witness to the manifestation of a monster. When she speak, listen. Lucy. She spoke. From Dev Mo to Lucy, I've watched her grow. She's perfecting her craft. The true definition of breaking the mold. It started almost eight years ago, and at 14 years old... All right, what I'm doing right here is that um, it's, um, I'm, taking a, I'm taking my heat gun, I'm heating up the mid show so I can uh, get the old fat to be glue off. And uh, as you see, it ain't that much glue, so it definitely shouldn't take long when you do this process. She gave me energy. I pulled this girl. Every word she said meant so much. 
一番遠いところにいるのに、一番そばにいる。She spoke. 愛してる。I love you. Go ahead. You the bottom part. Lucy. Back in 2010, Lucy used to tell me her dreams. Dreams of being known all over the world. Now you're about to see the world. Now it's her time to shine. All the talks are turning to reality. She spoke, and now it's happening. Lucy. Lucy, she spoke. It's a lingo. So you hope, you perceive. Cause it's you talking your life lessons and codes. And it's the first time you ever even spoke in their life. Spoke to who? The world. Maybe she Kobe on his last day. Ain't no maybe. Maybe she Frank Lucas with blue magic. Ain't no maybe. Maybe she 24, 832 magic. Ain't no maybe. Maybe she 27, 24 on Halleck. Nah, ain't no maybe. House in the Vandals. Y'all was there, stop pretending. Been a long time. Then play my role. Watch out. No curtains on that trap house. No need to close them curtains now. She got one part and then she bow. Wow, with the bees when he met Jermaine Dupree. I swear to God. At the James when she met Chase. Said last year, yeah, here we got the golden goose in that booth. Yeah, cause y'all please go ahead and pipe down. I put my hands up. Morning now, ain't no turning back, no, it ain't no how. Ain't no way. Maybe she just ill, gross, ill, gross, ill, gross. Maybe she just, maybe she just spoke for the first time. Hit it right, hit it right on the first line. Maybe she just spoke for the first time. Hit it right, hit it right on the first line. She Griselda Blanco, need that money pronto. Hundred candles on that table, plotting on you, blowing things. Don't meet me at that door, friends. Turn the foes, wiping they foreheads. Yeah, I know. Sweating the scene, wetting the white teeth. Still making my man need petty. I'm top coat, no coat. Petty on the lingo, shit slap like double D rope. Heavy with the forearm, trigger tuck. Say don't touch on her. Swerving out my fourth song, finna put myself on. Nothing thicker than that plot. Go and get the bitch for me. Couple white heads on me, feeling stormy. She spoke to the money. She spoke to the plot. No shopping when they gave the bags to her. She spoke about maneuver to that wave on maneuver. This climb ain't been nothing to her. More routes than a new 20. She really know what she doing. She spoke fluent. Now, as you see, the soul is clean. And all, all the all the glue is off. So the next step is definitely um, I'm gonna repaint the soap. What I'm gonna do? I got um, Angela's True Blue paint, the True Blue paint from Angela's, and I got the flat white, which I have in here, also Angela's. I just put the white paint in the jar. So、um, we gonna go ahead and paint this mid so, and we definitely gonna get to it. All we needed was the one time, one time for my niggas lock. I'm still screaming out for the guys. I'm old dog. If he hesitate, paint a clip. We can decorate. But I ain't really with the drama. I ain't in it if it ain't about a check, set, fam, or the commas. I'm just in it for the dollars. I'm a different type of nigga. I'm really cool with the killers. Some old shooters, Reggie Miller. These niggas in they feelings. Young nigga, but I'm focused. Boat flex, get your boat lit. Pulling niggas' cars like goldfish. 'Cause I ain't here for the whole shit. Whole set, whole set. Y'all niggas ain't fucking with us. Still no love for the other side. Middle finger to a fuck nigga. Fuck shit, we don't punt down. Free my little brother till he come home. You be telling lies and it's evident. Man, these pussy niggas be relevant. Jump top, drop top. Running through the city, I'm a big lot. Smoking bad wood out the zip lot. Niggas know me with a two glock. I went from nothing to something, nigga. Yo, baby mama be helping niggas. I been a nothing to. Yeah. North of city, what up? Oh, what a day! What a day! What a day! Hey, yo, listen, man, y'all niggas not gon' believe this shit, man. I'm telling you, this shit is crazy, bro. I know I be on some live shit, but this shit right here, my nigga, I can't explain this shit. I couldn't make this shit up if I wanted to, my nigga. Like, this is some real life little four wheel shit. Yeah. 
I'm on IG early, exploring all of my timeline, Insta snap pops, and all of the shorties go live, I seen a joint so fine, I was about to go slide, in them DMs head first, like a nosedive, but to my surprise, she jumped in mine quicker, saying I seen you watching, it's about time, nigga, I've been feeling your style, how you get down, and yeah, you fine, nigga. So when you free, shit, I'm trying to spend some time with you. I'm laughing now, she kicking game how I would her. No more talking, exchange numbers out, fall through and blaze the woods up. What I leave her with? She replied with this evening. Smirk emoji, yeah, shorty, I'll see you then. When you home, hit me on the bat line, and I'll be there at that time. And I'ma leave that pussy flatline. They ain't say that last part, but I was thinking it though. Fall through and drip my juice, have a drink and it's slow. First we get a couple shots, then drive her do a reckless. Work with Soriana, then she cooking breakfast on some set shit. Have a second, damn, you the best shit. Show her everything that a young nigga blessed with. That mad press tech, shorty, what's the address? Pulling up after the club, so no, I'm mad fresh. Drive her McFly, so the mag's on deck. I'm all about adding on checks, not adding on debt. Pulled up her silhouette is enough to make you break the bank. Walking closer, praying, please, Lord, don't be a jank. I know for Thadiana that had a couple of niggas party on her. See who like them pics, everybody on her. Everybody want her, hope them like Saint. Everybody on her, like equal to everybody on her. But fuck it, I'm in it till the morning. I'm here now. Premeditated murder, so that pussy been a goner. <laughs> in a, her crib, t shirt and boy shorts is little as shit. Whoa. Feeling like Malcolm about to be in the middle and shit. Whoa. But thinking Jack in and out of here nimble and quick. I'm but still a nigga, so she gotta remember this dick. Yeah. No waiting to hesitate, and I blaze it, then blaze it. I'm smoking, but she choking, that shit is so crazy. She pass out, so I get up to take a leap. Nosy nigga shit, medicine cab, take a peek. Bugging off what I see. Her name that made me trip like damn. Shorty is a local rapper's bitch that I did a feature with. So I know she seen this shit, man. She on some other shit. Ain't that about a bitch? Is all that comes to mind. And I'm glad she ain't mine. But I'ma hit it one more time and be out of here by nine. I gotta go. Cause shorty so fine. Yeah. I had to put this in a rhyme. <laughs> Damn. I mean, this shit ain't funny, my nigga. But it is funny, my nigga. Like, y'all niggas know I be on some wild shit, man. But she was on some wilder shit, my nigga. Like, God damn, how you explain that? And I know she seen the video because the nigga was fly, my nigga. I had it, you know what I mean? Was, uh, so I know she seen it, but uh, fuck it. As you see, I did a miss hole. So the next step I'm gonna do is um, put the finisher on. I'm gonna use this Angelus acrylic finisher. I do two coats of this, and then um, after the two coats of that, I definitely spray this Treehouse Studios studio finisher. I use, I'm gonna use the mat. And to me, this is the best brand to use, and the best place to get Treehouse Studio finisher is either online, or you can get it at um, Hobby Lobby. So we go ahead and get into that. All right, already got my um, my two coats of acrylic finisher on. As you see, I taped up the unit because I'm about to spray um, the treehouse finisher on. And um, usually when I do this, I probably do two, three coats of acrylic finisher. And then when you spray, you just want to make sure you spray just like that. Give yourself a nice distance and um, don't try to have it a nice flow, don't try to make it flowy, just nice sprays like that and um, give it a minute and then I'll do it two more times. So let it dry for a minute and come back and, come back and do it. The next step is that I got this hand all. And uh, once again, I want to shout out uh, FDC, my boy Devin Boswell at FDCC. He also said um, hand awls and supplies too. Once again, the link will definitely be in the description. And um, normally, before I actually do the um, the re the retouching up of the toe cap, the restitching of the toe cap, um, what I do is I kind of stab it and kind of loosen the holes up. So I always do this. So when I'm ready to, um, when I'm ready to reach this to sew, 
it makes it easy for me to do it without me struggling when I'm trying to put my shoes and put the um, threads in. Probably peach out the uh in the seven five rocking with reek bitch. I don't know your name, what's up? I'm gonna do the same thing with the actual rubber sole of the toe cap. And I'll just kind of loosen it up so once again when I do it, I definitely won't be struggling. Now the same method of me putting it back in It's almost the same method I use for the heel tab But this time it will be a lot easier because I'm dealing with something a whole lot bigger So I'm going to put the white shoe screen, the one that I want showing in the screen And now once again, um, I got this from FBCC Get this online too. This is what I'm gonna use for the um, for the back end of the thread. And this is what I'm gonna use for the front part for the part that's showing. And um, I got this at Michaels. I'm gonna get this at Joanne Fabrics. And um, go ahead and um, get into it. And um, this is a step that needs to be paid paid attention to very carefully. So, it doesn't matter which side you, you start with, you start from left to right or right to left. So first thing I'm going to do is, I'm going to put it in here, just like that. And I'm going to grab it from the inside of the shoe. Pull this out, and then just to show y'all that this is what I have right here. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to tie a knot in it. For resistance. Pull it through. And there we go. And then it's the same thing as the heel tab. But this time, this will be a lot more easier because I'm dealing with something a whole lot bigger. And of course, it have less holes. So once again, as you see, I got it. And this time what I'm going to do, I have my other thread right here. I'm going to use this as the back end. Like I said, I use me personally. I use two different colors because I don't want to get the colors confused if I use the same colors. Put it through like that, pull it through, and then I'm just going to pull on the other, other side, and then I will pull it in until no more resistance, and it continue all the way. They don't never have no work though. I be seeing them in work clothes. Man, these niggas frontin'. I ain't switched on my niggas yet. And I'm out here catching wreck. I feel like Tim Duncan. They still calling me Fleeto. Poppy keep calling my phone. He talking Creole. These niggas talking beef. It is what it's gonna be though. Come through, make a movie. Bought my man, he got the B roll. All my niggas do is win, win. All my niggas do is win. All we do is win. I flipped the pack and I did it again. I flipped the pack and I did it again. I'm trying to get some M's. My own family talk about me, nigga. So I don't trust a motherfucker, nigga. Motherfucker friend. All my niggas do is win, win. All my niggas do is win. All my niggas do is win. Uh, they heard my niggas getting mad, though. That's the reason why they mad, though. They seen us in the bins. These bitches say that I'm an asshole. I just been focused on this cash, though. These niggas need a friend. I know you say that you in love, bro, but that's my little slut, though. Your bitch be going in. And plus, Tia and Tamara with me. These two thirties do you dirty, bitch. I'm riding with the twins. Norfolk at your neck like a crucifix. Sit on your crib and everybody you maneuver with. MC with the hammer down to show them that my tool legit. If a nigga ever try to play me on some loser shit. Hating relatives, fuck them. We ain't gotta speak. Shit, your family do you worse than them niggas in the street. As you see, I'm on the last. I'm on the last one. Just like the tab. I'm gonna put it right through.
for the stand get the little roof out. I'm trying to get some M. My own family talk about it. As you see, on the deal, on the credit, right here. And then, for the rest there. Off. You can see the threads in the toe cap. Perfect and beautiful. And then once again, I'm going to use the FBCC. Shout out to my boy, Devin Broncwell at FBCC. I'm going to use the finisher blue. To the rest of the song. Huge tip, anytime that y'all have y'all glue stuck here like this, and you can't have none coming out in my case, you see none coming out, I just take my, I just take a lighter, just pretty much melt away the glue. And then once you melt away the glue, I'm gonna line this up the best way I can. I'm gonna do each part very carefully. Before you pull out some proof, wait on the bench or bet you some weight. Show what you do. Your imitation of me is a joke. You a spoof, but I laugh. You can smoke when I pass, just to be blunt. Spray you with what we keep in the trunk. Dumb boy ass nigga, come put your ear to the drum. I kick it good enough to hit a field goal from the one. I'm so sick like Neo, but don't they make me the one to do it three times better just for the place that I'm from? I'm saying give it five minutes for the food cure. No, you don't need to make me inspired. Don't feed the fire. You had a good year, my nigga. I never tire. Wash them and leave them wet like I'm in need of a dryer. You took a big L like the niggas that open fire on them. The life of a match is the way these niggas be lying on them. Lying on them. Just when you thought you could count me out. Now those same niggas lose the count. You see, I got the glue in. And you ain't going anywhere. <laughs> Alright, as you see the shoe sits, fits perfectly. Um, it sits nice and flush. So the only thing left for me to down, left for me to do now is re-glue it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with the actual um, mid sew. The actual bottom part of the missile and the rubber sole, and then what I'm gonna use for that is I'm gonna use um, FBCC shoe glue. Once again, my boy Devin Roswell um, shoe glue. I personally use this stuff. I use it on other shoes, and um, the link to his website will definitely be in the description. So let's go ahead and get into it. And I'm um, using the shoe glue. Um, you definitely want to add it on to both sides. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to add it to the actual bottom of the midsole and the rubber part right here. And you want to give it between 5 and 10 minutes to cure. Me personally, I give it maybe 8 minutes max. And when, when using this glue, you also want to make sure that you place it nice and carefully so the glue won't show. On the outside, because if you get any glue on the paint, it will definitely ruin your paint and you'll have to start all over with the paint job. So when doing it, just make sure you try to stay in the middle as much as you can. And as you see, I'm not trying to really get too much on the outer edge because once you press it down, 
it's going to squeeze the car anyway. Calling my phone, I just took you home. I need time alone. I've been, I've been in my zone. As you see, I'm climbing to the actual rubber part. Vision like a drone, leaning like a drone. If you do get the stuff on your fingers, it does come off real easy. So don't worry about it being stuck to your fingers. All you gotta go get hot water to come off. And uh, I'm gonna let it sit here. I'm gonna let it cure for like five to ten minutes, and then we're gonna put it together. All right. As you see, I waited about a good ten minutes, and um, like I said, the shoes should be definitely cured by now. So I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, Go ahead and put them together. And I'm um, gonna take my time to do it. Add it up, right? And you definitely wanna squeeze it out as much as you can. She say, baby, I need you now. Big daddy, please don't leave me lonely. Stop playing games, just don't put it on me. It's together like magic. Still want to squeeze and give it some time for everything to lock in. I got my bitches with me, bring your homies. And as you see, I got it on. I feel the hatred when I come around. in on the shoe. Pillow talking through the town, even homies talking down. So the next step we're gonna go to is definitely gonna up the car. Pick up a straight tick and take her straight to the doggy pound. Daddy is what they call me now. Got my old lady on my trail. She say I'm hardly round. Listening for that cocky sound from red bones, caramel, and even coffee brown. I wish a chick I ever hit would call me clown. These chicken wings be choosing. Yeah, they be on you when you get in it. But when you falling off, they all go missing in. So I just keep pushing them off me and extend them to a distant friend. Chill would told me control is the word. I keep that discipline. Car heart scully with the jacket with some timberlands. Cause my between, I gave it um, 8 minutes max and then what I'm going to do now is go ahead and put it together. And as you see, I got it together. And everything is nice and sad. And the only thing is I got to do is um, I'm going to take this my finisher and I'm definitely going to um, take my finishing glue. Take the finishing glue from the FBCC and I'm um, gonna use the finisher up in this area. Another shoe and press it back and it definitely will stick. Me personally, I'm trying to start with it back because it's the, it's the one that's pushing out more. So I wanna make sure I get this back part together first. Through the town, running up a check, niggas know the set. Yeah. Pay me my respect, really put in work, niggas know the rep. Whole set, screaming gang, gang, trying to stack my money up and maintain. Said she only down for one night, she don't know I'm with the same thing. And as you see, I'm just putting the glue in, pressing it down. And uh, one thing about this finisher glue is clear, so it doesn't really show if you overdo it that much. Real niggas really know me. Niggas, little homie to the OGs, free my little brother. Yes, outfit butter, yes. hammer all butter, chrome with the dutter, man stutter. Yeah. Even though I ride for the team, everything ain't what it seems. These niggas ain't stand up, whole lot of pussy in their jeans. These niggas don't go hard. As you see, the shoe is pretty much complete. The one more step thing to do is I'm gonna go ahead and paint this jumper. And after that, it's a wrap.
I know I do my thing and I be thugging. No one in this world is perfect, so how you judging? The nerve of y'all, cause y'all really be bugging. No emotions, three, yeah, if you've been up to something, man, they told me go and get it. If I want it, then I want it. Took me a little time, but damn it, my time is coming. They told me go and get it. If I want it, then I want it. Took me a little time, but damn it, my time is coming. As you see, the shoe is complete. See the new soul is on, the soul swap is complete. Alright y'all, appreciate it. Thanks for watching. It's a wrap, it's official. Um, full 100% restoration on these True Blue, Air Jordan True Blue 3s. Um, once again, I wanna thank God. Uh, I wanna thank everybody who's been watching. I think I wanna thank all my supporters. I wanna give a huge shout out to my boy Mount uh, at Set TV Video for shooting this tutorial. And I want to give a huge shout out to all the other customizers out there who's out there on their grind and also real serious about their craft. And um, and that's a wrap. Stay blessed, stay fresh, remain stainless. I'm out.